Hey guys, what's going on? It's Radius here, and in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how you guys can get the Opera GX gaming browser in 2021 on your computer. And this is a special browser meant for gamers that has a better performance than a regular browser. For example, a, like a default browser like Google or something like that. So I'm going to be showing you guys how you guys can download this and set it up. So make sure to watch the full entire video because there are some confusing steps. And if you guys did enjoy this video, please drop a like and subscribe because it literally takes two seconds out of your day to drop a like and subscribe. And it would honestly make my day because we're all, we're trying to hit 20k subscribers on the channel and i think we can hit that with the help of you guys so drop a like and subscribe and let's get into the tutorial so the first step that you're going to want to do is just go into your browser or whatever default browser you're using and you just want to type in the upper search bar opera gx browser just like that just how i typed it and then what you're going to want to do is go on the first link it'll be right here and the page will look like this basically and you can use this on iphone as well so if you guys want a tutorial on how to get this on iphone um if drop a like and if we get 400 likes on this video i'll make a tutorial on how to use this on iphone so what you're going to want to do is go at the top and go on download opera gx so then it'll give you the three steps so just run it so open the file and then just press upgrade and then just wait to it for it to extract it takes like a couple minutes depending on how good your computer is and now it's working and just let it run and, and the intro will go like this opera gx and the browser should look like this So right now we are on the browser, so I'm going to be showing you guys how you guys can set this up. So first thing you're going to want to do is make it your default browser. So it'll say, yes, it says, it's a, yes, set it as a default browser. Just press this and then it'll open your settings. But if that, if that isn't an option, you just want to type in the search bar of your computer settings, then just type in browser at the top and then just press choose a default browser and then just click on the web browser and then just click on Opera GX and then it'll save automatically. All right, so now that you have this as your default browser and it's completely set up and the download is set up, there is a few things that you're gonna wanna do. So you wanna start customizing it. So you can just go on the settings and then you can like choose like different themes that you want. I kinda like the red, but for this video, I'm gonna do the purple haze. And then you can do all these title animations, which I don't really know what that is. And then there is um, like GX lights that I guess you can connect them to your devices, like your mouse and stuff. And then you can use Twitch, GX messages icons. So I'm gonna enable all these. So, and then you can change your desktop wallpaper. So your desktop wallpaper is basically this. So to change it, you can like scroll and to match the theme, I'm going to go like this. No, uh, this one this looks pretty cool. Maybe this one. Yeah, that looks pretty sick right there. So you can change the theme or you can add like customizable wallpapers. Um, like this. That's my logo for YouTube, but I'm going to use uh, the green. So. So basically these, the themes is the, like the top theme and then you can add background music as well. So like you can add background music while you're using the browser. Um, but that's really up to you, your personalization. So once you have that set up, you can go in the top, right? Easy setup. And then now you can just, um, this is like an easy setup. So you don't have to use advanced. So for this, you can like change the colors and everything. I'm gonna use uh, the blue theme, like that blue, oh, that blue. And then you can do a secondary color too, which is like um, up here, but I'm gonna use uh, that one right there. Uh, and then you can do advanced options as well. So you can make more of a custom color. And 
you can do get more wallpapers and it will take you to this wallpaper site which has tons of wallpapers that you can choose from so to match the blue theme i'm gonna find a cool blue wallpaper so in my opinion i kind of like this one so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna download this so add to opera and just let it install and then go back on here and then it installed successfully so that's how to set up basic customization so the next thing that you're going to want to do is um, set up messengers and social medias. So I don't know if you guys have this option, but if you guys can see your social medias, you guys should be able to see your social medias like Discord, Twitter, Instagram. And if you see those, just go on each of them and then you can choose which ones to add from. I don't really have the option because I already had it installed. But for example, Discord, it'll just ask you to log into your account. Just log into your account. And then you can just do the same thing for Twitter, or Messenger, or whatever thing you use. You can choose more. I'm just using these because those are my three main social medias. And then you can even do Twitch too, like log in. And then the next part is like the cleaner. So this will basically clean your browser and like basically get rid of all the non useful things. You can get rid of all these tabs browsing download side icons and then just press start cleaning and then just wait for it to clean and it will clean basically everything and then you just press done and yeah once that's done that will clean everything so i recommend doing this about like maybe once a day or once a week it really depends how clean you want your computer to be and then you can go on the gx control option to limit some of your cpus and ram so to do this just go on the gx con a gx control and then you want to go on memory limit and then you can customize how much uh, i have it as the max but you can enable it so make sure to enable it and then you can customize it so i'm gonna um do the max and then you can do cpu limiter too so i'm gonna do that and then network limiter so network is kind of good so you can get more like better ping in gaming so you don't have to use all your so you don't have to use all your network on a browser. So it'll ask you how much MBS you have. So to do this, just go on speed test and go on your Wi-Fi, direct Wi-Fi, and then go on this one. It'll look like this. And then just go on to your settings. I'm just gonna connect to my Wi-Fi. And then just wait for it to connect and then you can reload the site and then just press go. So mine is going to be very high so we're getting around like 8 so MBS so 8 MBS MBS speed so you want to go back on GX control and then you want to go on 8 or whatever how much you use i'm gonna do 10 so so it doesn't go above there and then you can change like ram and then you can see how much uh what websites are using your ram and stuff and then you can also rate their like website so i'm gonna give it a five star all right so the next option that i'm going to be showing you guys is the gx corner this is basically where you can install games and play games through a browser it's pretty cool. There's a lot of different options that you can choose from. So you want to go in GX Corner and you can search for games, but like Windows games, Xbox. So I'm going to go on the NBA 2K and this is free. And then you can just download this with Epic Games. So it'll redirect you to a website that you can use for Epic Games. Epic Games. So Epic Games offers 2K for free. So this will basically basically give out all the offers and then let you choose from them that for you can download them on your computer so that's a pretty cool option and yeah that's basically the gaming corner where you can download free games and it gives out a whole bunch of offers for free games and then there's epic games too but um for this video i'm going to show you a couple more things so you can check your history like usual and then you can see your extensions that you installed um, I recommend using an ad blocker. This automatically installs an ad blocker, which is pretty cool. It's called Opera Ad Blocker, and it's like up here. So if you go on a website, um, I'll go on like Reddit, for example. 
you can just go on this um, privacy protection and then it'll see three ads blocked on this page seven trackers blocked on this page so this is a secured um browser and it's safety so yeah that's basically going to be the end of today's video as you guys can see this is um pretty basic tutorial if you guys want a more advanced tutorial um as i said 400 likes and i got you guys so as always guys it's been the radius i hope you guys have a great day peace out